Workers at the nation's only Lipton tea plant are rejoicing tonight. After a year of negotiations, the union has finalized its first contract for 240 employees. The plant is on West Washington Street in Suffolk. It is the largest tea processing facility in the U.S. Reporter Jonathan Costin talked to union members about what this contract means for their families. Union representatives tell us more than 100 workers voted for the union, while only six Lipton tea workers voted against it. And for the folks who voted for it, they say it was about spending more time with their families. But mainly it's just for us as having families, having sick time, having time off with your family, and then not only that, just having a peace of mind that you got good insurance and good benefits at the end of the day. Wally Lee was one of the Lipton tea workers who voted in favor of having a union shop. Workers say this Suffolk plant is the only Lipton tea company in the nation that serves the entire continent. So that means these workers put in a lot of hours and they lose a lot of family time. A lot of the people there that's on the floor with us are family oriented. You know, they have small children. They have children that's still in grade school. Some children is graduating from high school, but those are the times that you don't want to miss out on with family. Anita Anderson has been with Lipton for 11 years. She says the company used the draft system of taking time off. In other words, she says there was a mandatory overtime of 12 hour shifts. And if you couldn't report to work, you could be penalized. We was working 13 consecutive days before the company actually had to give you a day off. And then what? And then you had to start back over your 13 day policy again. Workers say now with the union, there'll be no more mandatory overtime. And instead of having eight days, they can now take off 10. In Suffolk, Jonathan Costin, 13 News Now.